Tombstone from 1994, is this the best Western ever made? Hey, what's up guys, it's Josh here. Today I wanna to do a little movie review on Tombstone from 1994. Now, I had seen lots of clips from this movie. I knew I had never watched Tombstone beginning to end, and it was a movie my dad really liked. And I remember growing up, I think I was in like seventh grade, people would always reference Tombstone or joke about Tombstone. So I knew a lot about it, but I've never taken the time, sat down and watched it beginning to end. And for me personally, it's probably my current favorite Western. All right, guys, let's jump into the pros that I had with Tombstone. And the first pro I have is that it's one of the best Westerns ever made. How do I not put that as a pro? Another thing I really liked about this movie is just great acting overall. Like everybody plays their part perfectly. Like there's nobody who even seems like they're acting or seems a little bit aloof. Everybody plays their roles correctly. And I think the for sure standout here is Val Kilmer. Absolutely blew me away. I'm not sure but I think they might have written him more into the movie because he was so good. By far the person that steals the show, love Val Kilmer in this one. One of the best parts about this movie is the epic scenes. Like there's multiple scenes that you could just go rewatch on YouTube and be like, that's just a badass scene. Why, Johnny Ringo, you look like somebody just walked over your grave. Go ahead, skin it. Skin that smoke wagon and see what happens. It's believable, but also very different. And they're all really cocky gunslingers. It's just got multiple memorable scenes, which I appreciate. For me, I really, really like story. I thought the story was pretty good here and I thought it had a pretty good conclusion. All right, guys, let's jump into my mixed aspects that I have with Tombstone. And my mixed aspects are, it feels very Hollywoodized. Like the villains are the cowboys. I don't think there was any real cowboys. The OK Corral, I think is what this is based on that happens at like 30 or 40 minutes into the movies and then the actual deeper plot comes in later when the cowboys try to take revenge on Wyatt Earp so it's just very very Hollywoodized I'm putting that in mix because I kind of like the flashiness but then I kind of don't like how it's just obviously not the original story all right guys let's jump into the cons that I have with Tombstone and the cons is some of the action just isn't as believable as it would be today I felt that mainly in the opening scene it just felt like people were almost shooting cap guns compared to real guns <laughs> At times it wasn't that believable. I would say it's almost the worst in the beginning, unfortunately, but maybe this is just me. I just feel like the gunplay and the action at times was a little bit weak and a little bit obviously fake, but this is almost a 20 year old movie at this point. And really the only other con I could think about for this movie is the no, no, no scene. No, no, no. Wyatt Earp is battling multiple people and they're hiding behind trees and he gets mad and he's just like, no, no, no. And he walks out in the middle of gunfire, in the middle of everything and everybody misses him. They even joked about it after, like I ain't never seen anybody who's ever done that. You ever see anything like that before? Hell, I ain't never even heard of anything like that. They kind of show that they know how ridiculous it was, but it just didn't need to be in the movie. And there was a couple scenes that were, it wasn't bad, but it was a little bit, just a little bit slower off for my personal taste. Overall guys, this is a great movie. I actually don't like Westerns that much. I'm figuring that out now, but I absolutely love this one as a Western. And I think it's definitely worth the watch just for Val Kilmer. He's just got a fantastic performance in this one, so. If I had to rate this, if I had to rate this movie, guys, I'd probably rate it an 8.5 to a 9 out of 10. And buy, try, or pass, 100% a buy. This is just one of those classic movies that everybody has to see. Go out and buy it. We're on the road to 50,000 subscribers, and I couldn't do it without any of you guys' help. You guys are the best. Having a great day out here. Hopefully, having a great day at home. See you all in the next video. Peace.